Alright YouTube and Fallout community, so I got some pretty cool news. Fallout Shelter is coming to the Xbox One and Windows 10 next week, as you can tell by the title of the article you are currently seeing on screen. This is actually pretty cool because I never got to fully play it. I downloaded it when it was kind of new, or when it first came to Android rather, because it came out on iPhone first and iTunes and all that stuff. Uh, I didn't really play it super in-depth, so this is actually a really cool thing. It's kind of weird, like, Bethesda hasn't really posted about it. They retweeted and uh, sent links from Xbox.com for this, but they didn't post anything on Bethesda.net for this. And it's kind of weird. You'd think that this would be a big, kind of a big deal, at least, at least for the game itself. Anyways, the article on Xbox.com reads, Bethesda Game Studios, the award-winning creators of Fallout 4 and Skyrim Special Edition, have announced that Fallout Shelter is expanding once more to a new audience putting overseers in control of their own vault and an army of dwellers on Xbox One and Windows 10. Fallout Shelter will be available on February 7th as an Xbox Play Anywhere title via a free download from Xbox Store and Windows Store. Fallout Shelter thrusts players into the role of an overseer to build their own vault, manage dwellers, and adventure through Fallout's iconic wasteland. Since the game's original launch in 2015, the game has continued to expand and add features, including crafting, scrapping, pets, additional rooms, iconic Fallout 4 characters, and special dweller customization options. The game's constantly growing quest system <clears throat> allows overseers to send dwellers out into the wasteland to abandoned buildings, decrepit vaults, and mysterious caves to uncover legendary loot and face off against enemies like rad scorpions, ghouls, and powerful bosses. As an Xbox Play Anywhere title, player progress is retained across both Xbox One and Windows 10, meaning users can switch seamlessly between platforms and pick up where they left off, bringing all their saves, progress, and achievements with them. The game also has also been fully adapted to work with the Xbox One controller, so players can experience Vault Life bigger and better right from their TV. Players can download Fallout Shelter for Xbox One and Windows 10 from the Xbox Store or Windows Store next Tuesday, February 7th. So I'm legitimately excited about this, guys, because this is a Fallout game that I haven't really experienced. It's, and it's got, you know, a little bit of Fallout 4 as well. It's got the characters and stuff like that, which is really cool. But it's some Fallout stuff that I haven't really played with that much. I played a little bit of it when it first came out. I don't even, I can honestly can't even tell you how much I didn't like it. My vault started sucking. I didn't know what the hell I was doing, so I ended up deleting the app. But this is, I'm legitimately going to down, download this and play it. You know, this is a fun, it looks like a fun game now with all the added content they have. And, it, you know, the fact that it's coming to Xbox One doesn't mean it won't come to PlayStation 4. Typically, Bethesda works with Microsoft and Xbox first on a lot of things, as we've seen with the PS4 mods for Fallout 4 and such. So, I, I don't know if the relationship is like Rocky or something with Sony. I don't know how that works. Sony's kind of uh, douchebags at times, I guess. I'm not sure exactly who's the fault. But I would imagine that this is going to come to the PS4 at some point. I just don't see them bringing it to a current-gen console and not the other one. It just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Either way, I'm happy it's coming to Xbox One, because that means I get to play it. This is a game I've been wanting to play for a while, but I, I'm not big on mobile games. I don't sit there on my... If I'm on my phone, it's to do social networking and you know, talk to people, maybe text, whatever the case. It's, I don't get on there to play video games. That's what I have a console for. So, now that it's it's the exact same game, but it's just going to be on my Xbox, I'll actually give it the time of day. I'm really looking forward to it. Anyways, guys, if you want to enjoy the video, if you're looking forward to playing this shit on your Xbox One, give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Follow me on Twitter. Links to my social networks are in the description and in the outro. Later, guys. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake, cause I don't fucking care.